Hello YouTube, if you subscribe and invite us to the Manning Social Network, you see the Dark King, and today, welcome to the new series, simply known as Manga Abridged. In this case, One Piece Manga Abridged. This is a series where I simply, well, abridge a chapter, basically. <laughs> so, it's kind of self-explanatory. Anyway, so, the first one, today, is, obviously, it's going to be One Piece 888, Lion. So, I hope you enjoyed this series, and with this overly and unnecessarily long intro done, let's get to it. The chapter starts with a cover page of Hideo and his boys officially starting the Hideo Pirates. They have the Jerry Roger, they have the ship, they have a mountain of bling, and they're ready to knock some heads. The chapter proper brings us back and dramatically to the mirror world. Where Katakuri has been punching Luffy off screen again. Nothing new. And uh, once again, Luffy's on the ground. New. Having no chance against the man that is Doctors. Not really his name, but hey, translations. So, once again, Katakuri dramatically shows with the mentality of the young Yonkos. Offering Luffy one last dramatic chance to join the pirate. The big man. Only to have his offer rejected with the simple answer, I came to beat you. Which, according to Charlotte Katakuri, really isn't an option. We then suddenly cut to a barrage of cannonballs being fired by the Big Mom fleet at the Sunny, which probably get tricked by Nami. And the Sunny remains safe. However, a report comes in. It would appear the Straw Hats have been pierced. For Daifuku and his fleet appear right over the horizon. With, to add drama, Smoothie right behind the main fleet of the Big Mom Pirates. Things look grim. And so, the chase is on. With Big Mom, somewhat slimmer, stealing her crazed rage for the wedding cake. So, as Aifuku and the boys prepared a barrage of faceless cannonballs. Which is an actually good idea if you think about it. We cut back to the sunny, where everybody is ready for a fight of their life. But then, suddenly, and you guessed it, dramatically, Carrot stops everybody, saying she'll handle this. After all, it's a full moon. She now can be useful. And so, it's time for the great Osaru transformation of the minx. We see her look at the moon. We see her tail grow. We see her eyes get red. Blood red. We see the claws. We see the aura. We see her hair turn snowest white. And so, we have Carrot in her stallion transformation. As a spit of wine, if you're honest. Now, let's see. What was that trump card capable of? Carrot jumps off the sunny, appearing to head into the water, but suddenly a flowing series of geppos allow her to, quite literally, fly. All the way so that the father characters try to shoot her and quickly realize that was a huge mistake, as she's now on her ship, and in her mink super saiyan form, starts clawing, starts biting, starts kicking, and start slaughtering all of the Big Mom Pirates, landing at the top of the ship, holding the helm. Which is obviously really, really bad for the Big Mom Pirates, since, you know, helms are kind of useful. And that's where we end the chapter, with a cute little powered up carrot, just grinning, as the straw hats are left in awe. So people, I hope you enjoyed this episode. <laughs> wow, carrot transformation was quite something. I mean, come on. Most of the fan base was expecting some were rabbits stash of crap, but guess most of them forgot we're dealing with Oda here. If you're expecting something, it's probably not it. Quite a majestic transformation, let's face it. And gotta admit, all of them is going Super Saiyan Wano. <laughs> That's gonna be quite the fight. If you think about it, Jack got lucky. If he had invaded only a couple days later, the last day before he used the poison would have considered with the full moon, and that would be GG. Well played, you're dead. Anyway, people, I hope you enjoyed this episode, and if you want me to do some back chapters, 
or other mangas, I have no problem with it. That doesn't ask me to do One Punch Man. I mean, the last chapter was 132 pages long. <laughs> that would be quite the abridged, the abridging. Anyway, till next time, don't like, subscribe, and well, we know the deal. Until then, I'll see you around. Ta-ta!